Last year, we asked our competition to pick the best personal computer based on price and memory. They all chose the Commodore 64. With all the changes in the computer industry, we thought we'd better check again. The new IBM personal computer chose the Commodore 64. The new Apple IIe chose the Commodore 64. The more things change, the more things stay the same. Commodore, in more homes than any other home computer. Given a choice between learning computing and playing video games, which do you think a kid would choose? Exactly. That's why Gore-Tec, a new learning game, was created exclusively for Commodore home computers. As kids play Gore-Tec, they're really finding their way around a computer keyboard and mastering basic computer programming. So before you buy a computer for your kids to learn on, make sure it's one they'll want to learn on. One that plays Gore-Tec and other painless learning games. The Commodore VIC-20. Some people buy an IBM personal computer to manage their finances. But after spending $1,355, what finances are left to manage? Others think one of those tiny computers will do. Fine, for storing a few phone numbers and recipes for Nestle Road Pie, there's a choice between spending too much or getting too little computer. The Commodore 64 gives you as much memory as the IBM at less than half the cost. Commodore computers, in more homes than any other home computer.